previously on my tongue piercing journey. I would have liked to have leave a little earlier. However, my dumb ass thought it was a good idea to overeat on breakfast and we got a little sicky sicky. If you scream and cry, we are gonna laugh. <laughs> Come along with the ride. Apparently tomorrow is gonna suck ass. Um, so here we go. I can already feel it. Like my tongue is already like, all right, you're done. Stop talking. So I'm gonna go. Are you this or no? No. no. So we're trying to eat and it's not working. I have to focus so hard. This is ridiculous. Aftercare is important. So, I got an extra soft bristle toothbrush, which we are about to open for the first time. I'm gonna even wash my hands first. And I got alcohol-free Listerine to rinse with, because we are not, oh my God, that double chin, who let me? Um, we are not about to get so it's dark, I apologize. Let me see if I can get some light going on in here. Um, so, update on the tongue. It's finally starting to hurt. And I say that as if it's like a good thing, like, oh my God, finally, but like, it's like, I'm not like bad, it's really not like, the pain in my mouth from braces was worse than this, but like, uh-oh. As you can see, like how swollen it is. And I was like, I think like making like, just like a broth or something will go over really well. It did not because it was really salty and it made my tongue hurt. So we decided to stop doing that. I barely made a dent in the soup. Like I barely made a dent in it. <laughs> I do love it. I love it a lot. And I'm really happy that it's there. But um, I came up, did the Listerine again, you know, did my cleaning process that y'all saw. I, th I think y'all saw that earlier. I don't know. That might've been when my phone died. But anyway, how my lips are dry, but I can't even get my fat ass tongue out to lick to my lips, but I just took some more ibuprofen. So hopefully that controls like tongue pain until I get to sleep. And then when I wake up, I'm gonna probably be in a bitch up mood. So we'll see. But um, just for like one more update. Ah uh, ha ha. Good morning, y'all. Oh my god, okay, it's day two. Oh my god, I just coughed and it hurt so bad. My tongue did not hurt today. I mean, I haven't been up for that long, but it did not hurt at all, but I just coughed and holy shit, that hurt. Mmm. Ow. Ow. Holy fuck. It didn't hurt. So just don't cough. Mm, you can see. She looks very sensitive. And it is very, very sensitive. We just had oatmeal, and it's not that, like, it hurts to chew. Like, that's not it. It's just, like, how sore your tongue gets. With the oatmeal, trying to, like, slide the oatmeal back was just impossible. I did eat almost all of it, though, so that's good. Like, how's all? You all saw a video earlier today when I coughed. Oh, that shit was so bad. 
I thought somebody was trying to rip my fucking tooth off. I have to go grab my toothbrush and my mouthwash. But I'm gonna go clean out my mouth. A lot of people really made it sound like day two was really bad. Like when I watched a lot of videos on YouTube, it looked like everybody on day two was like, fuck this, I'm taking it out. And like, I just can't relate. Like, I mean, okay, I took ibuprofen this morning after I had my coughing fit, but that was it. It, what time is it? I don't even know. A little bit too long for the ibuprofen to still be the only reason why my tongue doesn't hurt, but, um, like, and the only, like, really bad thing about my experience so far is that I can't fucking eat anything. Like, I'm so hungry. And, like, not even just, like, hungry because I'm hungry. Like, I just want to feel the enjoyment of full-on chewing a whole-ass burger again. Like, because that's just all I want to do right now. Like, I want a sandwich. I want a hoagie. Like... I fucking want this chicken that they're making for dinner. Oh my god. And I better be able to eat Thanksgiving. Because if I can't eat on Thanksgiving, like, nobody talk to me. Don't talk to me. Don't message me. Don't touch me. Like, I'll be so mad. I will be so mad. But, alright. I don't want to have, like, a lot of clips in here if they're unnecessary because I do plan on taking this video all the way out to my first week. So, I'm going to head. You'll get an update from me later today. Hey, also, I have an update. Um, I just successfully had dinner, and I'm full. I had so much food, and I should not be this happy over eating. But, oh, my God. On day two, even. Who would have thought? So. I am definitely bleaching. And she said that that would happen. We just did, like, chicken breasts. And she marinated them in, like, milk first, I think. And then Cheez-Its. Like, she took Cheez-Its and smashed the Cheez-Its up so they were breaded in Cheez-Its. <laughs> they were so good. And then she put them in to cook, put cheese all on top of them, and then more Cheez-It crumbles. And it was so easy to chew, so easy to swallow. We had mashed potatoes with it. Oh, it just made me so happy. And I only bit on the ball once, and it was on a larger piece anyway. So I wasn't able to get a full chomp down on the ball. It was just like a chicken and I felt the ball in between my teeth. So I lucked out there. Get you a man who gets as excited to talk about you as I just got about talking about that food. Like if my future husband doesn't talk about me the way I just talked about that chicken, I don't want him. I don't want him. What a fucking time. That just made my whole day. Like I am the definition of hangry. And, like, my happiness meter was just filled. Hey, y'all. It is the end of day two with the tongue piercing. And I have to say, I did not experience, like, any pain today. I took medicine twice today. Like I said earlier, I took some right before, or, like, right after I woke up. And I actually just took some... A little bit ago while we were watching the show but both times I took medicine was because I had coughed and like this part at the bottom like the ball on the bottom like when I coughed my tongue like went eh, and it like flew forward but it went so fast that it like got stuck on my teeth like that kinda and my tongue just like flew out of my mouth and like it like felt like it was ripping like somebody was trying to like rip it out which like hurt really bad and my tongue is definitely large and in charge right now
but like outside of swelling, it doesn't hurt. Like it's swollen. Yeah, but like it doesn't hurt. That's the end of day two. I will see y'all tomorrow for day three. Love yous. Good morning, everyone. I look like garbage. Hi, my hair. She looks cute, though. Thank you. Um, anyway, we are off because I forgot stuff at school that is kind of important. So I'm going to get that because today is the last day I can be on campus. Who can cook yet? We're kind of on a time crunch, but you know how we do. All right, we are never doing anything in a timely fashion, so it's fine. Um, we were going to leave at like what nine o'clock? Like nine nine fifteen. Uh, but I woke up. Aunt Jan woke me up at eight. Yeah, Aunt Jan woke me up at eight thirty, and then I set a bunch of alarms on my phone, and I was like, "Well, I haven't heard anything from Hannah yet." So I was waiting until I get a text message, and then I was like, falling back asleep and whatnot. Um, it's fine. So. A tongue update. This morning I woke up and my tongue felt really weird. So like on the top there. Wow, that's a different. Right, you're an ass crack. Is it on? Damn. <laughs> um, on the top, like it's just starting to feel really dried out, like where the swelling is making it kind of crater in. And she said that was normal and that's something that would happen. So like, I'm not really surprised. It is kind of annoying. Like I'm kind of over the swelling already. Like you've been swollen for almost 48 hours. Like it's not that serious. Um, so I don't know. I mean, my tongue was a little sore this morning. So I took some ibuprofen, but like still not as bad as like what people have made it sound online. Um, I just keep trying to like push the bar up from the bottom so it doesn't feel like there's so much pressure on the top of my tongue. Um, we'll see what happens. Hey y'all, back with Hannah again, what a surprise. Um, so today we did a lot of stuff for Lexi's sister's wedding tomorrow, um, which is why I haven't really updated the vlog at all today. Um, but today was the first day that my tongue like hurt but it didn't hurt like throughout the day. It hurt because I had pizza while wedding prepping and then wasn't able to mouthwash right after. So she just felt kind of spicy, like more than she like hurt. Um, she is still very swollen. And it's like creating that crater on my though. tongue. Oh yeah, for sure, but that crater on my tongue is the absolute worst. Once the swelling goes down, I think I'll be fine, to be honest. Like, I think once the swelling's down, I'll be like, okay, this is whatever. I hope you wake up tomorrow and it's Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that so too, but that's not what's gonna happen. Unless you get me like, ice that ankle melt all night long and I'll just wrap my tongue like, in ice all night long. I got my nails done for the wedding. <clears throat> yeah, that looks so bad. Yeah, we're gonna look cute tomorrow. Also, I'm like sad because I want to hit my jewel so bad, but I cannot. So I'm we hitting driving. it for you. Okay. Wow, we love nicotine. Wow, that was a lot of smoke. Probably. Yeah, from in Julia, it was. <laughs> Good morning. Today is day four. So the swelling is starting to go down because now it's just swollen around the piercing. That means we gonna be. Back to Dragon. normal soon. Dragon. Right. Uh, Alcohol. Dragon. Hello, y'all. It is dark, but once the TV turns on, it'll get brighter. So anyway, we had a fun time at the wedding today. I drank alcohol. Um. And hit my jewel well hit hannah's jewel even though i probably shouldn't have but like the tongue didn't hurt like my tongue did not hurt at all today um this morning it was a little uncomfy i think i talked about that in the morning clip but i mean honestly i don't know it's it definitely like re-swelled up throughout the day just because like eating and talking and whatever um, so like it was like it was like it's more swollen now than it was when I woke up this morning.
but I'm thinking like each day it'll be a little less swollen. But like, once again, I really don't understand what people were talking about when they said that it hurt so bad every day because it like didn't. It's just like swollen. Like, you're a lucky one. Right. I must be the fucking exception, but. Eh. Yeah, she still looks thick. You took some ibuprofen before we went to sleep, right? Yeah, I took some a little bit ago, and then I have some for tomorrow morning, and okay, then I gotta refill my jar. But, mm -hmm. yeah, so I just wanted to update y'all. Um, I actually did a pretty good job eating today. I only crunched, like, because I'm starting to, like, eat fast again, because chewing slow is boring, and I'm just impatient. Um, and I almost, like, hardcore chomped down on the ball today, but I didn't. I caught myself just in time so we almost had an incident but we didn't it's fine um i'm honestly just ready for like the swelling to go away not necessarily because like not because it hurts but just because like it's annoying you know what i mean so who knows we'll see but that was my day four update i think so i think tomorrow is day five so i'll check in in the morning Hey y'all, it is day five and I did not give an update at all today. It was just like a really crazy day. As soon as I woke up, I had to go. I slept at Lexi's again last night because of the wedding. Um, but so like when I got my tongue pierced on Wednesday, we had said about going to the wedding and drinking. And she said like, prepare for your tongue to swell up really bad on Monday or like on Sunday if you're drinking on Saturday. Um, but it didn't. <laughs> Like, it didn't really bother me at all. And, like, that's the thing. Like, I feel like every single thing that I was, like, told to be cautious for, like, is not a problem. Um, we're gonna move over to my room because I was just rinsing out my mouth again. I don't know. Like, I feel like this video isn't gonna be helpful because a lot of videos on YouTube were, like, here's all of these, like, horrible things that I experienced afterwards. Or, like... Here's all the bad parts about getting a tongue piercing. And all I have to say is like, yeah, my tongue is swollen and I can't eat. But like, even then, like I'm eating fine now. Like I still have to be careful, but like, I haven't not ate something because I was afraid of how it was gonna hurt my tongue. Like anything that I wanted to eat, I ate and it was fine. Um, you can see like some of the bar now, which means the swelling is going down because two days ago, you couldn't see any of the bar at all because my tongue was that swollen, but. Like, I don't know. I think you can see it. I don't know, like, I really have not come up with, like, any reasons in my head that would say, like, don't do this. Like, a lot of people are, like, if you can't do this, like, don't do it. But, like, the bulk of my pain, like, in the aftercare was a day or two. But, like, by day three, I was, like, good. Like, I'm still not talking as, like, normally as I would want to. There's still some syllables that are like whatever and like it still gets sore if I talk a lot but like even then it's not like an oh my god my mouth is so sore let me go get medicine it's more like a let me shut up for five minutes and drink some water. Sorry I didn't like update y'all more throughout the day but like there really wasn't anything to say. So who knows maybe I'll have more tomorrow maybe I'll have less. But I'll still at least update, like, before I go to bed every night, like, once a day. So, we'll check in tomorrow.